Welcome to Top Crew Aviation. This is Captain P. K. Yadav. Welcome back, guys. As uh, I gave you some, uh, you know, compulsory reporting points and uh, stations to find out your concern ATC over there. So now let's uh, find out the solution. Next, I gave you guys uh, overhead uh, Ranchi flight level 200. So I gave you overhead Ranchi flight level 200 and uh, we all are aware about like uh, Ranchi is nearby Jamshedpur and that is nearby Kolkata. So guys again your uh, chart number is 4 only and uh, uh, here is Ranchi guys uh, let me tell you this is Ranchi so overhead Ranchi flight level 200 we have to find out the ATC guys. So overhead Ranchi, the first ATC available is Ranchi Tower and the limit of Ranchi Tower is uh, from uh, ground level to flight level 100 and there is one tower available that is just Ranchi Tower and uh, our flight level is 200. That's not uh, sufficient limit uh, for us to find out the ATC. So this is the same area which uh, we discussed earlier guys. If you come from uh, Khajuraho to Calcutta guys so this is uncontrolled area guys as uh, we all can see there is no TMA boundary guys so uh, guys as we are aware I discussed about this fact earlier too this is uncontrolled area and no FIS is given no defense control is available in this vicinity guys we look for the overhead ATC and there is no overhead ATC then uh, we go for the next en route ATC guys so you do have two options like if you are flying towards Khajrao there is a en route uh, ATC would be Varanasi TMA if you are uh, flying from Khajrao to Calcutta and next en route ATC would be Calcutta control guys. I told you guys uh, doesn't matter wherever we are flying in this area we would always call Calcutta control guys. So do not get confused so you guys uh, might be in confusion some of you have uh, chosen in case if you have not uh, got that information properly and maybe you didn't uh, take attention at that time while I was telling you like you have to always call Calcutta control so this is the scenario guys so you always have to call Calcutta control never Varanasi control guys even though I have told you a couple of times uh, people still uh, make mistakes guys so don't make uh, these kind of mistakes we have to always call Calcutta control be clear about this all right guys next guys I gave you a Revo and uh, flight level was uh, 210 guys again guys uh, this is also in your chart number 4 and uh, Arivo is here is your Arivo guys now you have to find out uh, your ATC guys so Arivo all right and uh, at uh, flight level 210 I told you guys so how you are uh, going to check this okay so uh, as we all are aware like uh, there is no tower available nearby there is no approach available and uh, we all know uh, this is the Arivo is coming under uh, Varanasi TMA guys now what do you guys make mistakes you guys uh, choose the Varanasi control and you forget about the vertical separation guys okay as I told you that's why I told you each and everything before proceeding further so that you do not make any kind of mistake don't forget guys in this area there is a vertical separation all right so till flight level uh, 255 from flight level 200 you have to choose Nagpur control not Varanasi control in case if you are not aware about uh, vertical separation guys uh, there is a separate video about vertical separation and I explained about each and everything about uh, almost uh, all the charts uh, vertical separation available on all the charts guys so in case uh, if you are watching uh, this video guys the uh, very first time I would uh, request you to uh, go back to that video vertical separation 
then you will come to know why we are talking about here why we are choosing Nagpur control in place of Varanasi control okay guys so your correct ATC would be Nagpur control at this place Aribo guys I'm sure it uh, is clear guys for you in case of any confusion let me know I'm here to help you okay next is uh, Lapun guys that is also available in uh, chart number four as uh, we all are aware very well now so just nearby Aribo there is a Lapun guys uh, look at over here okay so this is Lapun uh, now uh, I gave you the flight level a uh, one a uh, five uh, zero so overhead Lapun as we all are aware there is no tower available no approach available we always look for overhead ATC guys but in this area there is a uh, Nagpur control available from flight level 200 to flight level 255. So even though our flight level is 150, we will go for the Nagpur control because that is our overhead ATC. All right, guys. So this is how we choose in case of no ATC available. We look for the overhead ATC, whatever ATC is available in case there is no overhead ATC is available we go for the end loop ATC guys okay so we will discuss uh, again and again about these situations then you guys will get familiar about these things need not to worry in case if you are uh, making mistakes again and again it's a part of exercise everybody takes time guys about uh, these charts and RT but try to have fun with this uh, do not get bored try to have fun guys this is really very interesting in case you guys are getting bored let me know I'll make sure that you guys have fun with these uh, charts routes and uh, ATCs guys it's very interesting and I love this I'm telling you about me okay next uh, I gave you about uh, Nina at uh, flight level 50 guys okay so again guys uh, chart number four and uh, I'm sure you guys must have located Nina guys let me tell you where is the Nina guys in chart number four and uh, let's have a look here is Nina guys so you have to find out uh, ATC in chart number four and uh, overhead Nina and flight level is five zero guys now uh, the same procedure which we discussed uh, we are doing practice with the so many examples guys so that you know we do not get any kind of confusion in our head so overhead Nina flight level 50 we know there is no tower available there is no approach available we are in the boundary of Nagpur TMA now we have to check what is the limit of Nagpur TMA so this is the limit of Nagpur TMA guys from flight level 100 to flight level 460 as there is no ATC available we always go for the overhead ATC so who will be our overhead ATC that would be our Nagpur control guys okay so in this situation also our correct ATC would be Nagpur control so we have discussed enough guys about the examples all right let's go ahead further uh, let me check what i gave you next example or next question guys i know there is no rocket science in it uh, because i'm the one who gave you these points so i know where are they you guys must have took you know a lot of time to find out so that's really good and even i took the same time when i learned very first time so you need not to worry about anything guys it takes time uh, slowly or gradually these are just eight charts uh, we would uh, come to know about each and every corner of all the charts uh, by practicing all of them all right guys so don't worry have patience all right so guys uh, as i told you in uh, chart number four there is a melex okay so at melex at flight level 100 as we all aware there are two atc available at Aurangabad, the tower and approach tower limit is from ground level to flight level 50 so we cannot call tower even though we are in the radius of tower we would call approach uh, that is above uh, 50 as we all are aware you know the limit of approach is uh, from uh, flight level 50 to flight level uh, 150 so our correct ATC would be Aurangabad approach overhead Melex at flight level 
one zero zero. All right, guys. All right. So next one is uh, active at uh, flight level one two zero. Now uh, we will start about uh, like uh, let's have a look. That's again in chart number uh, four, guys, and uh, where it is in chart number four, guys. And uh, now look at over here and over here. This is in uh, Mumbai TMA, guys. So this is your active, uh, and the flight level is one two zero. You have to find out the ATC. And uh, now it is clearly visible on the chart, guys. Uh, that is, uh, you know, under the boundary of uh, Mumbai approach. So we have to find out the limit of Mumbai approach just to double confirm that, guys. Okay. So flight level is one two zero, and uh, just to check about uh, Mumbai approach, guys. What we need to do? We know the limit of uh, Mumbai Tower, and uh, that is uh, from ground level to flight level seven zero. We always disregard this, uh, which is uh, written inside the second dotted line. We always confirm. Uh, look at over here. This is the uh, limit of Mumbai TMA, and we know the limit of uh, Mumbai Tower. So in between would be your approach, and that would be from. Flight level seven uh, zero to flight level one five zero. That would be your Mumbai approach. So your correct ATC at uh, active and at flight level one two zero would be your Mumbai approach, guys. Okay. Next one is Dotip, guys. Uh, that's also nearby this active. Just uh, this one is Dotip at flight level five zero. So as we all are aware, our approach uh, there is no ATC available. We are outside the boundary of tower, inside the boundary of approach. But our limit is outside the approach. But still, because in case uh, we do not have any ATC available, we always look for the overhead ATC. And their ATC available overhead door tip is above flight level 50 is guys uh, that's uh, Mumbai approach. So the correct ATC overhead door tip at flight level 50 would be Mumbai ATC guys. I hope uh, you guys have understood in a proper way. We have uh, exercised enough examples uh, with the different situation. So I hope, guys, it is helping you to get clear picture in your head. Okay, guys. So take care and bye for now. Here you go. Your checklist. Like, subscribe, and share. Thank you for watching.